Right. Let's send it over to Paul for a check of the weather. I'm headed over to Zoo Lights tonight. Is that going to be a good night for us light lookers? Yeah, you'll be, you'll be <laughs> fine this evening. Called? Light lookers? <laughs> yeah, you'll be fine this evening, Karen. It's when we wake up tomorrow morning that we're going to have this stuff. Now, it's going to be snow to the north, and then somewhere between 8 Mile and 94, I think there'll be a transition to a wintry mix of sleet, freezing rain, and even just plain old rain. So let's explain what's going to happen here. So let's take an atmosphere which is entirely below freezing, and now let's introduce a wedge of warmer air above freezing temperatures aloft. So this is all below freezing, the dark here, and this red is above freezing. If you have clouds in the warmer air and it starts raining and it's above freezing all the way to the ground, well, that falls as regular rain. But now let's take a cloud that's in that warm air and it's raining, but that rain now falls out of that warm air into sub-freezing temperatures near the ground. That's freezing rain. So it falls as raindrops, but those freeze on like power lines and roads and things. Now let's take again a cloud in that warm area and it's now got a thicker layer of cold air, sub-freezing air to fall through. Those raindrops freeze in the little tiny balls, little pellets. We call that sleet or ice pellets. Those are those little things that bounce off your windshield. And then let's just take a cloud that's in the sub-freezing air. It starts snowing, and it's, of course, below freezing all the way to the ground. It falls to all snow. So now you see what's going to happen tomorrow morning. That last part where you have that little thin area of the warm air, that's going to be all snow. In the middle there where we had that transition to falling out of above freezing to below freezing, that's all this stuff. And then down here in your Lake Erie where it's going to be above freezing, that's going to be all rain, guys. Thank you, Paul.